Hello, this is Sensei Michael with Falcon One Karate. Today we're going to work on Kusan Ku Kata, which is a black belt kata for Ishinu Karate. So the way I'm going to do it is the first go around, I'm going to do it slowly, speaking out the movements as we go, uh, trying to help you at home be able to learn the techniques, learn the kata. Uh, then after I do that, I'm going to do it again, but more fast paced. Like you might perform it at a rank test or your class or a tournament or something like that. So if you already kind of know it and you just need a little review or you want to watch it a little bit more in real life, then just skip to the end and watch the second version. Okay, first version is for you while you're still kind of learning it and you need to go a little slow step by step. Okay, so Kusan Kukata. Begin with a lean, hands come in front, over your head, okay, it's kind of a protection. You can use this as a push off if somebody's coming in, also as a feel around. Okay, while well, you're getting ready for the attack to come in, kind of a little bit of the peace before the storm. I'm going to reach out. Okay, now the bad guy's coming in, maybe I touch him with this front hand. Bam, palm off, palm him away. Now I'm going to drop down into Zenkutsu stance. Left hand goes up high, right hand down low, block the groin. Then I'm going to switch, boom. I'm going to middle block left. I do a stomp to draw attention over there. I'm going to do an angled punch here, pull back, stomp the right foot, angle, punch here, left. Pull back as a guard. Now I'm going to look right, they're coming in from behind. I go to cat stance. I'm going to do a trophy kick, which is a snap and a back lift. Boom. Here. Now I'm ready for the next attack. I step, I keep my hands up in front. Guard. Step. I'm going to step in. Now this time the attack of punch is coming in. I'm going to palm it up out of the way, pull in and punch to the body. I pivot my feet, I'm looking to the back. Left hand, punch to the body. Step, right hand, punch. I look left, punch is coming in towards my head. I'm going to do a left hand grab as I turn into crane and chop to, uh, chop up by his neck. Boom. Right leg snap. Bam. Okay. Now I'm going to look left, come down on my knee, block, stand up, punch. Pop the cat, chop. Snap, right leg. Look left, come down on the left, uh, right knee. I stand up, punch right hand to the solar plex. Look left, tap coming in here. I go to cat, trophy kick, circle left, drop down my right knee, right elbow. Look behind me, enemies are coming in, I'm going to cat, okay, I do trophy, bam. Circle, elbow strike. Look left, come up ready position. Step, I'm not ready. You don't want to rush through the cottage, it's a good time to slow it down. A little bit of showmanship here. I'm ready for the next attack. Now I reach out left hand, attack is coming in, maybe I brush him, maybe I touch him. I pop back here, go into a crane, chop, snap kick, step to the side. So left foot goes into crane here. I hammer fist, hammer fist down low. Could be blocking attacks coming in. Bam, bam. I'm going to go step back, right foot in front, middle block, punch, punch. Look left, cat. Okay, this is our spinning crescent kick. So I'm going to reach out left, open my left hand. All right, I'm going to do it slowly here a couple times so we work on if we're practicing it. So my right leg is going to swing up to where you almost give yourself a high five with this hand. You hit them in the head, you know where they are, I'm going to aim for that target. Come up, give yourself that high five. Swing it around. Next step is you swing it up, high five, spin to the back. The kicking leg, right foot, should go in front, okay? So I go back this, open, swing, down in front, then I drop to the ground. Kind of looking for the next bad guy, I'm ready for the next one. I'm going to switch, right leg's back, left leg in, look, look, okay? Bad guy's coming in, I step up right foot, middle block right hand, punch, punch the sole. I look left, I go back into dragon tongue here, hands on the hips. Cat stance. Now they come in, maybe with a punch or a kick, I'm going to palm it out of the way. I'm going to step across right foot into crane, spear left hand, or sorry, right hand. Now I'm going to spin on my right foot. Low block. Bad guy's here. Snapping back fist. Bang. Circle left. Elbow strike. Open my hands. I'm going to do a Maywashi technique. Rotate my hands here. So I'm like this. Bad guy's coming in here to grab at my chest. I'm going to rotate, step out, left foot, push off. 
Okay. Step left foot, break. Look right. Spin around. Okay. Left foot facing the back. I do a downward hammer, downward hammer. I'm kind of in Sayuchin stance right here. Open my hands, double chop up to the throat. Take my right foot, I spin, double knuckle over the right leg. I come back, cat stance on my right foot, left foot in front. I'm going to do a distance kick. Okay? So my right leg is going to come up, and I jump kick to the back. Okay? Step right foot, little block, punch, punch, look left, ready position. And we come hands together, one, two, three, and back. Okay? Now, as always, when you learn a kata, uh, I wouldn't try and learn all of it at one time. You just break it up into bits and pieces. So just work on the intro section for a while. Just replay it, back it up, replay it, replay it until you get that memorized. Then you go to the middle section. Okay, I'm going to work on that until I get that. And then maybe the end. Okay? Because it, it can be a long kata, uh, a little hard to memorize. So just break it down to make it easy for yourself. Okay, I'm going to do it one more time at a little bit higher pace, uh, a little bit more power to it. So this is what you're, you're working up to uh, be able to perform it, like for your rank test uh, or a tournament maybe. Kusan Kukata. Kusan Kukata. Thanks for watching.